Oklahoma freshman running back Joe Mixon has been suspended from the football team for the entire season. I'm Jim Basswell with the latest ESPN headlines. Mixon charged with misdemeanor assault this this past Friday. He was accused of punching a woman in the face. We are joined on the phone by Jake Trotter. He covers the Big 12 for ESPN.com. Jake, the team did their own investigation, and what did they find? Well, it led to the charges that were filed, and I think Oklahoma felt that they were serious enough, you know, given that it was you know, alleged violence against the female student, that they they had to take drastic action, and that that obviously involved uh, resulted in Mixon being suspended for the entire year. So, what does this mean for his future with the school and uh, obviously the football team? Well, we'll have to see what happens uh, in the criminal uh, proceeding, but in terms of the football team. You know, he's out for the season, so you know, he, he has a choice. He can stay at Oklahoma and try to come back for 2015, or he can transfer and go somewhere else. I, I don't have any indication that uh, he's looking to leave right now, but uh, you know, he's, a, he's an immense talent, a five-star recruit, and a lot of people would be after him if he made himself available on the transfer market. What's the chances he faces any jail time? Uh, unlikely, and it is. The crime he's been accused of or charged with, you know, carries a penalty of up to one year in jail. I'd be surprised uh, if it made it that far. You know, these things tend to get worked out uh, outside of court. You know, the possibility is there, but, uh, you know, given the, the remarks from the DA in Cleveland County, I would be surprised if it, this ultimately ended up with him going to jail. So, Jake, it was just a week or so ago we were talking about linebacker Frank Shannon's suspension. This is a team that has an awful lot of expectations coming into this season. How much do these off-field issues collectively get the ire of their coach, Bob Stoops, with regards to not only how they're perceived, but how it's going to impact them this coming season? Yeah, there's no doubt it's been a distraction. You mentioned Frank Shannon, obviously Joe Mixon. Uh, the Doriel Green Beckham situation has been ongoing since he arrived on campus. They're trying to get uh, Baker Mayfield eligible, the, the quarterback transfer from Texas Tech. So it really has become the dominant storyline uh, this preseason. Uh, all of these players who were in limbo, you know, they're trying to expedite uh, the Shannon situation uh, possibly by this week to, so they can move on with that. And then uh, they're waiting to hear back from the NCAA on DGB and, and Baker Mayfield. But uh, there's no doubt that they're ready for the games to start because it's been uh, a newsy uh, preseason for yeah. the Sooners and not necessarily in a good way. Absolutely. He covers the Big 12 for ESPN.com. Jake Trotter, we appreciate the insight. Yeah, no problem, Jim. Again, freshman running back Joe Mixon suspended for the coming season for the Oklahoma Sooners. You can read more about this story right here on ESPN.com. With the latest ESPN headlines, I'm Jim Basquale.